A significant milestone is being marked this week with the official commencement of infrastructural works for the National Agriculture Innovation and Technology Center. This state-of-the-art facility is poised to revolutionize local agricultural practices by integrating cutting-edge technology and sustainable farming methods through hydroponics. A five-member technical team from Guyana is currently on island to spearhead the installation of a highly advanced agroponic system, an initiative that symbolizes the beginning of a transformative collaboration between St. Lucia and Guyana for agricultural technology adoption and innovation. What we are seeing here today is the beginning or the foundation of the agricultural innovation and technology initiative that our ministry is hoping to stretch out to youth or to expose more young people as it relates to new in new production methods or techniques and this has all been made possible and we are so grateful to the Guyanese mission for coming in and starting us off so when more more of these new technologies come in we are able to take it on on our own and show our young people from start to finish what they could accomplish and how far agriculture could take them. On this lot, we hope to establish, I believe, one, two hydroponics greenhouses. The hydroponics center is also expected to serve as a model for local farmers, demonstrating modern techniques that maximize crop yield while minimizing environmental impact. Officials from both countries emphasize that knowledge sharing and capacity building will be key outcomes of this initiative, fostering a stronger regional partnership in agricultural development. So five of us came to assist you guys, um, St. Lucians, uh, to set up two shade houses. Um, there will be tunnel houses, and uh, we're, we're uh, going on well. Uh, we're almost finishing one of them today. Um, we want to start the other one tomorrow. So hopefully by Saturday or so we can be putting on the plastics on these, these shit houses. The National Agriculture Innovation and Technology Center is expected to set the foundation for future advancements in smart farming, data-driven agricultural solutions, and climate-adaptive practices. With construction now underway, stakeholders remain optimistic about the center's impact on food production and economic growth. From the Ministry of Agriculture, this is Amanda Fee Clark reporting.